Now, first alert weather with Caitlin Napoleoni. It's 5.15 on this Monday morning. We've got some rain moving through northern New York, but the bigger concern is going to be way off to the north along the border, uh, the freezing rain, which for roads up there will be very, very slick. And we'll even see some of that in the northern Champlain Valley pretty quickly here. This is all moving to the east, and even some clouds filling out over the Connecticut River Valley. Some scattered showers for them later on this morning. Very warm temperatures in the uh, southern portion of the Champlain Valley. We've got some warmer air building in quick, uh, along with a pretty breezy wind, southwesterly wind getting us up to 50 this morning, which actually breaks our record high, uh, ties our record high temperature for the day. Huge, uh, big different story to the north. It's much cooler. We've got a northerly wind kind of competing back against that, that war uh, warmer air to the south. Uh, but the warmer air will eventually uh, win out later on today for some of those northern areas. And you can see that wind right now, 15 miles per hour from the south right now in Burlington, warming us up. But that temperature will fall later on this afternoon very, very slowly. It's kind of like a small burst of cooler air thanks to a cold front. It's going to drop us into the low 40s by later on on this afternoon and also we have the breeze along with that. A secondary burst of some of that colder air is expected later on tonight and all that does come along with some precipitation. First it's the rain again maybe some mix this morning as that moves on out to the east. The afternoon brings some sunshine and then later tonight that secondary cold front brings a chance for some snow. Maybe a couple flurries a dusting here or there and then we dry up for your Tuesday. It's actually going to be a nice day as, you know, as long as you don't mind those cooler temperatures. Then Tuesday night into Wednesday some snow also some mix and eventually some rain early starting to mix in and then we'll see some lingering snow throughout the day into Wednesday as well. So this is about what you can expect Tuesday night into Wednesday. Uh, this is just a very broad generalization. Everyone's going to kind of get something different. We're going to have periods of that warmer air building in and also the colder air taking over behind ahead of and behind the system. So everyone's getting a little bit of the snow at different times. It starts as snow, turns to rain and then finishes as snow. And during all of that, you can expect in some of our western areas close to six inches of that snow. I think the Adirondacks probably in between there as well as the northern portions of Vermont and the Northeast Kingdom. Uh, the Champlain Valley is kind of right in the middle of that as well. Probably one to two, maybe three inches expected there while more of a mix and rain the further south that you go. Again, that's Tuesday night into Wednesday. Uh, so again, a dry period after some rain and snow later today and tonight. Then we've got the snow turning to rain during the day on Wednesday and then back to snow Wednesday night as we warm up and then cool down quickly on Thursday and cool and dry for the end of the work week.